hey good morning so um, today I'm working on a picture schedule for a student that has a really hard time kind of staying on track staying focused on what he needs to accomplish during the day <clears throat> so what I have is you see there's velcro on the back so it's it's portable but it also can go on the student's desk and for this student being finished with something and not seeing it is very motivating so I've put a little finish right here on the front of it so what the student will do is they'll start in the morning with their schedule open so they'll see all the things they need to do during the day. Once they come in, they've finished breakfast, they can close that, breakfast is finished. Then maybe they have their morning work. When their morning work is done, they can close that. Now morning work is finished. And then maybe for some reason, the student needed a break or was really having a trou um, some trouble kind of concentrating and they didn't get to this language arts, that's fine. You know, So that's not finished yet, it's okay. The student went ahead and maybe they didn't finish writing either. It was a, a real kind of meltdown and they just needed to take a break for a little while. Maybe go talk to a counselor, maybe talk to a, a student a teacher in the school that they can kind of um, sit with and open up to. They had lunch. Lunch went great. Now they're back on track. They get to their math. Um, <clears throat> maybe um, they're doing some, some prep during the day. Um, maybe they skip this. Maybe they're like, you know, I think I'm ready to get back to that that writing. So now we can just come back up, do the writing, and that's done. And now the student can see, wow, all I have left is I've got special area. Um, you know, my, my extended day is coming up, dismissal. Really, this is all i got to do, and then I'll be done for the day. And so they can just kind of go back. And that really kind of helps the student feel accomplished, feel motivated, kind of like a list. They can check it off. Um, super easy to make. I just printed this side using Word. I inserted the pictures using lesson pics. Um, and then I printed it. And then on the back side, I just also made these in Word. And then I glued them on, put it in laminating film, slid it through. Once it was all laminated, then I cut it. So it's cut. And then I put the Velcro on this side. The way I do Velcro is soft, is stationary, so the, um, that way if I have change anything, I know when I go somewhere soft is going to be the stationary part that sits, and the hard um, loop is going to be what's going to be on the side that moves or the picture that moves. And then once I've got the Velcro there and I have the Velcro here, now it's able to close and it is finished. Okay. Thanks for watching.